Geography affects communities and the people who live there. Geography is the study of land and water and the way people, plants, and animals live there. The environment makes up a community's geography. The environment is the natural world around us. There are many kinds of environments. Environments can be flat or hilly, lakes, rivers, mountains, and the forests are different kinds of environments. In each different environment, you will find different kinds of animals and people. You see, a community's environment and geography affects the way people live. The food they eat, the clothes they wear, and the houses they build all depend on their surroundings. For example, there are many communities in Northern California that are surrounded by forests. The forest has an effect on the people who live around it. Many of them have jobs in the forestry industry. River communities aren't the only places that depend on water. Trees are a natural resource. A natural resource is anything found in the environment that people can use to survive. The trees are cut down and sawed into boards called lumber. Lumber is used to build homes all over the country. Trees are also cut down to make paper and other products. When trees are cut down, new trees are planted to take their place. This way, we don't use them all up. This is the Mississippi River. It's the largest river in the U.S. Towns and cities near the Mississippi River are called river communities. They depend on the river for many things. They use it to transport food and other goods from one place to another. Some boats that travel up and down the Mississippi are called paddle boats because they have a large paddle that makes the boat go forward. Ships can take oil, farm goods, and even people up and down the river. The river connects communities to each other. River communities aren't the only places that depend on water. There are also ocean communities. Many communities are by an ocean. Some ocean communities have harbors where boats and ships can dock. A harbor is a body of water that protects against the wind and waves of the ocean. Large ships from all over the world sail into these harbors carrying goods. Once they're unloaded, the goods can be placed in large trailers or containers and shipped across the country. When goods are shipped into a community, it's called importing. When goods are shipped out of a community, it's called exporting. Fishing is also important to an ocean community. In San Francisco, Fisherman's Wharf is a place where people buy and sell fresh fish caught from the ocean that very same day. <laughs>